Now, if you can't have Bono at a U2 show, these are some pretty great stand-ins. Hey guys, I'm Sylvie Schlazy, and U2 minus one is what's trending on ET Now. With Bono out sick, recuperating from a nasty bike accident in New York City, U2 hit the stage in Times Square for World AIDS Day on Monday with the help of some famous friends. Chris Martin and Bruce Springsteen each filled in on vocals alongside band members The Edge, Adam Clayton, and Larry Mullen Jr. The Coldplay frontman killed it on With or Without You and Beautiful Day, while the boss took charge on Still Haven't Found What I'm Looking For and Where the Streets Have No Name. The Times Square concert event also featured performances from Kanye West and Carrie Underwood. Now, if you missed the event live, Bank of America Red is still showing all 50 minutes of the show on YouTube. YouTube has much to celebrate this month. Rolling Stone has named the band's latest album, Songs of Innocence, as the best album of 2014. Quote, there was no bigger album of 2014, said the mag's editors, in terms of surprise, generosity, and controversy. You can say that again. The album famously dropped for free as part of Apple's iPhone 6 announcement in September. The album showed up in iTunes users' libraries whether they wanted it there or not. Well, when it comes to YouTube's World AIDS Day show, we're still waiting on the final tally, but sponsor Bank of America did donate $3 million to the Red Organization to fight AIDS. But I want to know, what did you guys think of Chris Martin and Bruce Springsteen's performances? Hit Twitter with your thoughts. I'm at Sophie Shalacy, and be sure to use that hashtag, ET Now.